Trash day. Man, I am going to see what's out here. See what's out here. Nicky waved at me. He's my neighbor. He was kind of hippie. Man, that vehicle's making some noise. That's a Ford Explorer. I had one of them just like that. And that sucker decided to quit running. Never could figure out what was wrong with it. Never could figure out what was wrong with it. I don't see much out here. Good morning, dear. That was a young girl. So, she's bigger than an adult, but so how do you know it's a young girl? I guess. Well, they look. They look young. They don't look. Uh. They don't look older. I don't know how you tell. You just tell. I mean, there's boys in high school that's as big as me. So how do you tell they're young and I'm old? <laughs> I guess. I'm trying to beat the garbage truck today. I got started later last week uh nothing I'm going to try and get Publix today. No. Now, is there anything down this street? I don't see a dang thing. So I'm not going down that street. I'm going to go down this next. See a cat under the car. Meow. Meow. Okay. 
I may find something, I may not. Right now it's not looking too good. I don't see much of nothing sitting out. I notice it's get daylight. Morning daylight is coming later and later every morning and the daylight savings time does not change until November 3rd, so we got about a month and a half before it changes. Oh, it changes. What is it? What is it besides the empty boxes? That's what it is, empty boxes. And my friend wrecked his truck. They just quit putting cans out for me. You know, there's a subscriber, um, I don't know if he's a subscriber or not, but he's leaving comments, and he's saying I need to drop the Publix thing. People are not interested in me going to Publix and spending money he he's saying um the people's interested in is me getting scrap and making money well This is my neighbors that used to drink a lot of beer and they quit. Boy, I mean, they is. How in the world could they go cold turkey on the beer? I don't know. Gotta adjust my mirrors. sewage place is stinking this morning. I'd hate to live right next to that thing. My latest man from the yard sale today. Maybe I can round some more stuff up for. Got a lot of stuff sitting out there. So far, I so far I ain't seen a garbage truck. I don't know why, but I've decided to nothing. You know what else is pretty about clouds? To be in an airplane about 30,000 feet up, up above those clouds and looking down on those clouds. It's just almost like, it looks like you could get out there and just kind of lay on them and stuff. But of course you can't. You do that and it's gonna be like Humpty Dumpty had a great fall.
Well, I ain't seeing much of nothing. I can't tarry too long because I got some that person that was supposed to come haul all that stuff off yesterday didn't show up. <clears throat> he wound up in the hospital and his wife is coming with her sister to haul it off and I guess they can handle it. <clears throat> I mean there's nothing out here. Nothing. Yeah, this guy saying I was sitting in being including the public trips. Um, he might be right. He might be right. He might be wrong. Man, I might. I, am I wasting my time? Jeez. I'll go a little ways up here, but it's not looking. It is not looking good. Um. Uh, nope, this is not, I'm going to turn around right up here. I swear that's a beautiful tree right there. I wish I knew what that was. It sure is pretty. Yeah, I'm wasting my time. I'm turning around. I'm going to go over to the other neighborhood. Gee. Gee whiz. All I got's a few cans. I'll tell you what folks, if if the prices keep going down on scrap, I I ain't gonna make nowhere near what I made last year on the aluminum cans. I ain't gonna make nowhere near cause they're 31 cents a pound now. Used to be 85 and 90 cents a pound. Heck, steel used to be, uh, I remember when it was between 10 and 15 cents a pound. I'll take a little bit of a trip down this road, but it ain't looking too good either. Holy crap. Nope, no need of me going any further down. No can there. And I forgot to bring me a plastic bag. And I had a subscriber left a comment and said, take a roll of duct tape with me. And when I see bags sitting out there that's got cans in it and I won't rip them open because I don't want to make a mess to get the can, I said rip a hole in that bag, get the cans, and then tape it shut. And that thought never occurred to me. And I thought I had a roll of duct tape this morning, but I don't have any more, so I had... I, I don't, uh, 
I don't have any duct tape, but that that makes so much sense. And it don't have to be that good duct. It can be that cheap stuff, that Chinese stuff. And by the way, I was found out that police, a police officer can, if he sees me breaking the law, riding down the road, going against traffic in this thing, or running stop signs, and just traffic infractions in general that's not safe, they can stop me, write me up a dang ticket. Sure can, and if you're drunk, they can charge you with DWI. Sure can. I didn't know that. I did not do that. Did not know that. Now see, here comes some bags. Now if there's cans in there, I'm screwed because I don't have that tape. But I will get me a roll of duct tape and <laughs> there you go. I see two cans in there. Son of a gun. I, that kind of disturbs me the way he, that subscriber talking about uh, the reason I don't have many subscribers and all that stuff. It kind of made me mad, but then again, he, he's just saying what he thinks, and I appreciate that. Oh. Uh, I can't remember if I'm recording or not. Gonna, yeah, I'm recording. I was sitting here talking to myself. Well, you know what? Even when I ain't recording, I'm talking to myself. Constantly running my mouth going down the road. It's just got to be. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's the YouTube virus that I got. Yeah, some, some, and maybe it's something, maybe it just goes with being a YouTuber. But, yeah, he's, I, I'll talk about that more on my live tomorrow, you know. Uh, there must be a deputy, that, well, I guess I'm sure there is, Sheriff Marion County. That's a deputy that lives right there. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't want to be breaking no laws. Uh, no. Nothing. Take a look. No, no. Hey, somebody getting in the car down here. I'll tell you what, Slim Pickens today, that's going to have to be the name of my, uh, uh, next video, Slim Pickens.
Ah, man. Oh, I wish my life was still here. Damn it. <laughs> That'd be so nice to go home. You know, get off running my little run here and go home and she'd be standing in there fixing breakfast or cleaning something and <sighs> the dauber surely didn't know the treasure he had while she was alive. Is that a can? Yeah, it's a can. But you know what? I got this sorry pickup stick. But I got her. Now, I done forgot what I was talking about. This is that place that's always got cans. But I don't see no cans. Nothing in there. Well, there ain't no cams in there today. You know what? I ain't never seen one of them blooming like that. Is real flowers, isn't it? Yes, it is. I want you to look at that. Beautiful. 
Absolutely, there's one, two, four, five. There's five flowers blooming on that. I sure didn't know them things did that. How about that? Well, who would think that them fires, they need to straighten them up. What about that? Okay. Nothing. Definitely nothing. Oh, that was. I wish this thing had a suspension system on it. You know what? I'm right here behind Publix. I was fixing to go in there. But I think I'll just skip it. Maybe I do go in there too much. I see a pink bottle over there, but I ain't getting up to get it. I don't know what I want it for anyway. There's the blue bottle. I'll wait till I got my good pickup stick. Oh, there's the pink bottle. <laughs> what I want with pink bottles? What I want with blue bottles? Maybe I have a blue and pink bottle fetish. There's the swamp. I'm gonna go in here and check Miss Caroline's hands. <clears throat> See what she's got. See a bunch of cars there.
Oh yeah. That was a nice little batch of cans from Miss Caroline. <coughs> So today is not a total bust. Not a total bust. Oh. Okay. Homeward bound. I ain't got nothing but cans. <coughs> no scrap whatsoever. <coughs> okay. You know what? I am almost tempted to go across the road here. Into that little neighborhood. Let me look in my rear view mirror. Yes, ma'am. Well, I'll start saving them for you. Let me give you my card. Hush, hush, hush. Yeah, Don't. I'll start saving them for you because we have tons of them all the time. I, I, I've been thinking about uh, passing out some cards and everything. Let me get in my pocket and get them out. Um. And if you... If you save them and when you got them, if you'll just hang them on the inside of your fence. Okay. And when I come by, I'll come by two or three times a week. Can okay. you reach that? Do you know what days you come by? Uh, just about every day. Just about every day? Then I'll hang it like on that end post over there. So you don't have to come all the way this way. Okay. Okay. All right, yeah, I, I I do that, and it's just, it's not much money in it, but I'm... It's something to do. Retired, I'm disabled, and right. I can't just sit around not doing nothing. Right. Keep but, you busy doing something. Yep, yeah, sure does. Yeah. And anytime you got it, look on the back, you see on the back of the card, too, there where it says the other stuff that I get. Okay. Um, Anything electrical or... Uh, small electric appliances and stuff like that, and mm -hmm. copper wire and the computer parts, computers, anything like that okay. that I can scrap. I appreciate it. I, my dog similar to that. Is that a Jack Russell? She's. I think she's a corgi mix. I think I, I got her from um, the Humane Society, so they weren't a hundred percent sure, but. I think she's a corgi mix. Yeah, I love my she dog. Might have, she's real calm though. She's not like hyper like a Jack Russell. She's she's real calm. Yeah, those Jack Russells are really wound up. Yeah. All right, well I'm gonna check your cans here and uh, okay. I I appreciate it. Yep. 
What's your name? I'm Ashley. Ashley? I've seen you come by several times and I thought that's what you were doing and there's a guy that used to come back from this way on a three-wheel bike yeah. and he would do the ditches and stuff and but I haven't seen him in a long time. I don't know where yeah, he is. He... I hate to throw those away. We just don't have a recycling thing here and I don't have a truck so I can't yeah. take them off. Well, I'll definitely take anything like that that can be recycled. I wish I could take the big stuff anymore, but I can't do it. You know, I just don't. Uh, start with the steel right now, you're only getting two and three cents a pound for it. Yeah, no. And that's not much. Cans are down to 31 cents a pound. It used to be 85. Wow. Um, but. Yeah, I know I called because I have some property up like uh, two hours from here. And um, my dad recently passed and he had some cars and it was six cents a pound. Really? I'm like, I might as well just keep them till it goes up, you know? Yeah. You might as well give them away for that price. Yeah, it's, it's kind of versus how much trouble it is to take them to the scrapyard and everything. Last time I sold a car though, it, it went for almost $500. Wow. But not it's so. Six cents, you know, if you got like. 3,000 pounds, you ain't getting, but like, yeah. you know, it ain't much. 60 bucks or something. It ain't much. All right, well, I appreciate it, Ashley. All right, my name's, care. all right, my name's Russell. All right. Really all right. Well, that was well worth the trip. Well, this is nice. <laughs> okay, just set them there and I'll, I'll come get them. Thank you, dear. Could be a good one.
Hey guys. Good little scorn, she will save her cans for me. So that's another source, and they go through a ton of them. She said they're beer drinkers. Oh boy, there's one in there. There's some kind of I don't usually go in this little neighborhood here, but I'm glad I did now. Boy, I like that man shit. Wow. Wow.